Welcome to Chakra Yoga for the Immune System. How can that be? Because your immune system is not one little thing. It's comprised of magnetic field, all right? How to charge this area and keep it strong around your body. When it's strong and powerful and vibrating at a really high frequency, you feel impenetrable. Nothing can get to you, and it's true. Nothing can. When there's holes, things get to you. Next line of defense are the centuries of your body, your glands, your lymph, okay? And glands sit at the chakras, okay? You can go through the chakras and go, hmm, pineal, right at the crown, pituitary, right at your third eye, thyroid and your parathyroid, throat, heart, thymus, okay? And your first and second chakras share the adrenals, those glands that we all go, oh my God, my adrenals are so blown, right? Some people don't even know it, but the reason you need that cup of coffee in the morning is to jumpstart your adrenals, because they're gone, all right? Third line of resistance, third chakra, digestion, okay? Your whole digestive system, colon, small intestine, stomach. The number one selling over-the-counter drug in the United States is antacids. So it tells you something about the fact that we can't digest everything. Not only we can't digest our food, we can't digest all the information coming at us. When this system is clean and clear, at least you have a chance to have a good connection to what goes in here and what's able to come through you, okay? So this immune series is to help you to maintain physical, mental and spiritual health. Because when you're sick, you don't feel very fabulous as a soul either. When you feel very strong, your heart, your spirit has a chance to come forth and you get to feel like there's a tomorrow and you're not afraid of it. Your immune system gives you that power to be the centuries, be the stronghold that it was meant to be for you. These exercises are geared to all of these centers. They're geared to making you strong, powerful, and that you know how to adjust your own immune system, which is incredibly powerful. You can become your own healer because nobody is as in touch with your moment-to-moment -moment changes as you. What do we say? I feel like I'm starting to come down with something. Oh, down, going in not feeling strong and uplifted and projective, all right? So these exercises, do the whole series. Get to know them, get to use them, get to really feel like they're your friends so that you can go through the changes of the seasons feeling strong and alive and healthy. Healthy of physical body is much easier to have a much more healthy soul and life. We're going to start out with a wonderful chant. You're going to bring your hands together, all those beautiful nerve endings into each other, and bring it into what's known as your mind nerve, your sternum, the vagus nerve, which connects heart and head. And the thymus sits right on top of your heart. You're going to take a deep breath in, and we are going to chant Om Namo Gurudev Namo. I bow to that infinite wisdom within, within me, within the universe, within the depth of our connection. Inhale deeply. Bring your hands together and into your heart. Take a deep breath.
The first exercise we're going to do is called thymus thump. Doesn't that sound wild? It's to activate this beautiful gland called our thymus, which most people will tell you, oh, it only works until you're about 13 years old. But it has a tremendous amount to do with your immune system. It helps produce white blood cells, and it's like knocking at the door. So all I want you to do is put your hand right over your sternum, then you're going to move it slightly up, and all you're going to do is tap. And I'd like you to actually rap like you're rapping at somebody's door, not just a little tiny tap, but really just hit. Hit your chest, and you're going to do this for a minute. Just close your eyes, get into it, and if your immune system is down, this is going to feel very sore. If it's not, just practice it for when it is. This is a wonderful exercise that helps to stimulate your thymus. You're just going to take your fingers and wrap on your own chest. Just knock at the door of that thymus. And you can do this for one or two minutes at a time. Anytime you start to feel like your immune system is going down or you're coming down with something, do it immediately. Just breathe into it and tap your beautiful thymus. Guru Inhale deeply, hold the breath, and exhale. 